a precise and cost-effective strip test named after a hugely popular Satyajit Ray detective called Faluda is now being used to detect coronavirus disease. This test can actually produce results within one hour and it's expected to go into phase one clinical testing in about four weeks. Now, Faluda is also the acronym for the FN-CAS9 editor-linked uniform detection assay, which uses CRISPR gene editing technology to identify and target the genetic material of SARS-CoV-2, which is the virus that causes coronavirus disease. And this has been developed completely in India by the Council of Scientific and Industrial Researches, Institute of Genomics and Integrative Biology, which is based in Delhi. So Feluda testing combines CRISPR-based biology and paper strip chemistry. So basically what happens is the scientists take the Cas9 protein, which is a component of the CRISPR system, and this is barcoded to interact specifically with SARS-CoV-2 sequence in the patient's genetic material. So now this complex of Cas9 uh, and uh, SARS-CoV-2 genetic material is then applied on paper strips. We're using two lines, which is one is for controllers and one is for testing. Uh, this is may, makes it possible to determine if the test sample is infected with SARS-CoV-2. So now the entire diagnostic process takes about one hour, starting from uh, RNA to giving the visual readout to uh, the person doing the test. Now the best thing about this test is that it can be done in any lab. It doesn't need uh, high-grade labs which have high bio, uh, biosafety levels uh, because usually for a PCR testing you need biosafety, at least biosafety level 2 or 3 for the test to be done. So this can be done at any lab. So the US Food and Drug uh, Administration just, just about a fortnight ago gave approval to the world's first CRISPR based test. But unlike the test that's been developed in India, the, the, the ones that has been developed in the US still needs high com complexity uh, labs to actually perform the test. So scientists in the US who have actually developed it are now working on more simplified versions that they hope can be uh, used uh, in, in uh, public health settings and in, 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 uh, labs. So this is something which has already been done in India. And what scientists who are not associated with the test say that uh, this, this method of testing, the Faluda that Faluda uses, CRISPR-based testing, is very accurate and accepted, accepted testing me method across the world. And anyone, even lab technicians who uh, have been trained can do it. So right now we don't really have enough people who are trained to do it, but training them, say scientists, is fairly easy. And uh, it can be uh, done uh, very quickly so that this test can actually be rolled out once it's approved by the government. Now, the acronym FELUDA, of course, wasn't a coincidence because uh, as it happens, both the scientists who've developed the test are uh, Bengali. But interestingly, the name wasn't, um, uh, wasn't thought of by uh, the scientist, but his wife, who's not a Bengali, but, but he says she knows that he's uh, obsessed with the test. CRISPR, which is short for Cluster Regularly Interspaced Short Palindromic Repeats, is a gene editing technology that can be used to detect a specific snippet of, of DNA or RNA from a sequence. So this can be then used to turn genes on or off without altering their sequence. So now Feluda's use is not limited to COVID-19. In fact, the scientists working on it started working uh, on the Feluda uh, test about two years ago and they were developing it as a uh, test to work uh, on detecting RNA and mutations in genetic sequences. And uh, But when SARS-CoV-2 struck the world and COVID disease uh, spread across the world, they decided to come up with a test to detect uh, coronavirus disease. So now this is the only COVID-19 testing kit which is which uses the, uh, the CRISPR technology and now Feluda has been licensed to Tata Sons who will be commercializing it for the detection of SARS-CoV-2, the virus that causes coronavirus disease. And the interesting thing is right now, the only test available for coronavirus detection is the RT-PCR test, which costs 4,500 rupees per test. Now this test, the cost of the lab is just 500 rupees. So it can bring down cost hugely across the country and help to scale up and test a lot more people. So then we'll actually be testing people who may not even have symptoms. Uh, this, this test is going to become affordable once uh, the, the test is approved and licensed for commercial use.